So Team STJ, we're back with some brand new NBA 2K15 news for you guys, or a video if you will. You know, we were finally given some next-gen news for the first time this year. Our first glimpse of some gameplay, so I'm trying to make the most of what we got because we have no idea when we're going to get more. So, you know, we're just trying to enjoy the moment right here, have some friendly discussions, and I really do appreciate all the support and all the awesome feedback that you guys are giving me. And we're going to be talking about a graphic comparison, if you will, from NBA 2K14 and of course the brand new game coming out this October NBA 2k15 so we got two screenshots as you can see of Kevin Durant on NBA 2k15 on the left and of course Kevin Durant on NBA 2k14 on the right so we're gonna be really going in depth about this discussion of course I want to ask you guys what you guys have to say of course too in the comments because that's what I do YouTube for I love hearing what you guys have to say and that really makes me do YouTube because man that's why I started to hear what you guys have to say honestly so let's be real Kevin Durant on the left is 2k15 one thing you're gonna notice between the difference of these two pictures immediately is that lighting has a big time emphasis on the picture on the right 2k14 this picture of 2k15 is without any lighting there is no lighting at all on the 2K15 picture, which makes it a lot more impressive because when you add lighting, when you add the smoke, it obviously gives more of a realism touch and obviously makes it a lot better looking, if you will. This trailer was just straight up gameplay with no lighting at all, and that really made me happy because if they did add lighting, in which they probably will in the game, it's just going to make it look more even, it's going to make it look more crazy, right? It's going to make it look more crazy. You're also going to notice a lot more things in terms of the the arms you're gonna notice that Kevin Durant's arms in the left picture obviously 2k15 it's a lot more realistic in NBA 2k14's arm you can obviously see the glimpse of sweat you can see his bicep and his deltoid you can see those two things really defined both differently if you will too you really can't see that on the right picture in 2k14 you can notice so many small small things as you can see you can notice sweat you can notice some you know glimpse of sweat on his right arm too so you can definitely notice there are some drastic changes in NBA 2K15. The small things, right? You know, you can be expecting the graphics to be like legit and super 100% different from like, you know, current gen, I mean 360 to the Xbox One or PS3 to the PS4 because that's physically impossible. But you got to notice the small things and once we see actually more gameplay and the physics of the game, I'm sure it's going to be a lot better. But like I said, this his face even in the 2K15 one looks a lot more realistic. They upgraded their face scanning system and I honestly think it worked off but I want to hear from you guys 2k15 versus 2k14 which screenshot wins hope you guys enjoyed I'll see you guys soon peace